my second home. I feel like like my friends are not just my friends, they're like my family. We take care of each other and we cry together too. We have this really deep connection with each other. Our students are, are here for a reason. They're here because they, they want to learn, their parents want them to learn. When I see the children in the library and they're going through the stacks of books and, and they're, they're really looking at it, it's okay, which one do I choose? And you just watch their faces their passion for what they're doing, for what they're learning, it just shows. It shows in their faces, it shows in their body language. We are a school of the three A's. Academics, the arts, and athletics. I'd like to think that I'm pretty solid academically, and I also am part of the soccer team, and I lead one of the academic competition clubs. Two main activities I'm involved in is uh, soccer. Uh, I'm the soccer team captain and a student government here. It's kind of a skill of the 21st century to become more and more independent and more and more responsible for their own learning. I was having a 2.36 GPA, and then I started to have 3.3 GPA, and then I have 3.84, and then now I have 3.98. KS is unique in that there's um, emphasis on both sides of the spectrum. It also kind of like attracts these kind of students. So the friends that I have, they, they really care about their academics, but they also care about sports. The kids here are very driven, they're hardworking, they're goal-oriented. The school is set up to accommodate those qualities. I applied to UBC, University of British Columbia. In, that's my dream school. KAS has a, a really distinctive community feel and certainly in the high school a lot of the students know everyone and so that's, that creates to a, a really nice feeling in the school. We really want to teach people to cooperate. It's all about getting along. I'm teaching in a school where English is their second language and the open communication that goes on here is better than any school I've ever been in my career. If we can't get along as a school, how can we expect the world to get along? All my friends are all unique. None of them are like the same. And um, they're all unique in like a very, very personal way. To be able to interact with them is kind of like a privilege. All my closest friends have been with me since sixth grade. So it's very, it's very special and I'm really lucky to be here to have these friends.